everyone. Welcome back to Fish Hunt Northwest. We're here in the kitchen with Chef Kelly. And I see some steaks. They must be deer, elk. I think it's elk backstrap. You got it. You okay. Won. You're just they killing it. They look very lean. Yes, extremely yes. lean. And they're very thin, too. But uh, yeah. you know we're going to deal with it, and, and it's going to be delicious. This is going to be your get-out-of-jail-free card. You know, Even if you bought a gun, you probably could get away with <laughs> cooking this and then be like, oh, we're good. It didn't even. <laughs> well, next time I'm going to jail, I'll be sure to make this uh -huh. so that sure, I sure. get out of there quicker. So we're going to season it with a little bit of kosher salt. You're hilarious, mister. I know. Yeah. A little Have bit you of had to use this? Garlic powder. Me? I'm never in jail. <laughs> I hope not. I might get struck down here. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh-oh. A <laughs> little bit of fresh ground black pepper. So what's the actual dish that we're making here? Well, today we're going to be uh, pan searing these, uh, these backstrap steaks. Okay. And then we serve it with a Roquefort cheese uh, chai mash uh, and a uh, fig... Uh, red wine butter sauce. Okay, so okay. this cheese is, what's it called? Roquefort. Okay. It's cousin to blue cheese. It's from France. Uh, it's kind of lost out of its, its way. You know, you don't really hear about people talking about Roquefort anymore. Uh-uh. And, uh, and I don't know why it has... Oh, you know, um, my family, when they had a, a cafe, yeah. the dressing. Roquefort yeah. Roquefort dressing. Yes, absolutely. I just got that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay I remember so, that. We're gonna add, what do you wanna say, a half cup? Yep. Half figs. cup of dried figs. Dried figs. Yeah, quartered. Right. Okay. Uh, we're gonna add about two, three tablespoons of sugar. I'm sure that's exactly three it is. tablespoons. Uh huh. And this is the fig sauce that's going yeah. over it? Yeah. Okay. Okay, and there's about a cup of red wine. Okay, okay. so the other thing I'm gonna add also to here. Uh, to give it a little bit of viscosity. Viscosity. Yeah, it's uh, fig butter. Always have to use the big words around me. Uh huh. I got fig an impression. Butter. Fig butter. See how beautiful it is. Yes. Yes. So if you like figs, you're gonna love this stuff. You serve that with your cheese trays, I bet you. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. Here. Okay. Okay. So that's getting all nice and happy. That's gonna get reduced down. You know, beautiful. Looks very appetizing. Okay, so now we're gonna work on our. Uh, let's see. Ashley, could you microwave this for thirty seconds? Sure. Okay. And this is the cheese. That's the Roquefort cheese, and, I, and what I'm doing is I'm just kind of uh, softening it up, so when I mix it with the mash, that uh, it's going to uh, melt into it, and it's not gonna be so chunky. Okay. Because that is an issue. Yeah. Okay, we've got our pan, ripping hot. Don't overcrowd. We're not gonna move it very much. That's me, it is what it is. Uh, okay, we're also gonna be working on our veg. We're gonna add a nice big fat tablespoon of Work. butter. We're gonna season our butter. Hey, remember, you don't want to forget about our... Smell that. Our steaks. We're trying to shoot for medium rare. Okay. Okay. And you already blanched your asparagus. Yes. Now I already pre-blanched my asparagus so that we ensure that uh, we kind of lock in the color. Bright it's easy color. To cook. Okay. Yep. Okay, that thin guy needs to come off already. Yes, they're done already. Wow. We're gonna, we're gonna rest them though. Okay. These guys are just a hair thicker. Butamus. Okay, in this pan here, I have a, a white wine Verblanc sauce. That means it's just a reduction of white wine, a little bit of vinegar, 
of cream and then we're going to add just a touch of butter to it. Okay. Okay. So white wine, cream, and what else did you have in there? Uh, black pepper and uh, a little bay leaf too. Okay. Okay. So set that down there. Ooh. Okay. Boy, you sure messed up my stove top. You still love me. <laughs> I do. Wondered if okay, you were gonna so, respond. <laughs> right? <laughs> okay, we're ready on there. All right. Okay, and our fig sauce is beautiful. Let's turn everything off. So quick. Yeah, right? I mean, that's... Yeah. Okay, so now we're just gonna work on our mash. So our, our mash is still hot from earlier. I don't need that one. Okay, our Roquefort cheese is slightly melted, but that's okay. Um, so this is just potatoes pureed with a little bit of, Ooh. little bit of cream. <laughs> Starting a fire in my sink. It's okay. <laughs> Well, if you're gonna have a fire, that's a place to have it, right? I know, right? I'm gonna add some chives. Now, as you see, I haven't seasoned, I haven't mentioned anything about seasoning. You know, Roquefort's very salty. And yeah. So we're gonna taste and see where our salt level is. Okay. And uh, make sure you're not gonna over stir that because we don't wanna make like don't gummy, want it to be... gummy mash. Yeah. Use a little salt. And we'll fresh cracked black pepper. Mm -hmm. and just barely blend it together. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. All right. So now we're in our restart plate. Okay. Okay. I do not like that. Can you take that? Mm-hmm. Okay. Do you need this? Mm, no, thank you. So you just, did you blend those in your processor is what you did? Yeah, it wasn't uh, my probably my first choice, yeah. but uh, it is what it is. But it's what I had. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Where is my... Usually just want to mash them a little bit? Well, or? no, typically, you know, you know, everybody has their, uh, you know, potato masher. That's mm -hmm. fine. It just doesn't get it absolutely super, super smooth. Okay. And uh, I like a ricer is probably number one. Food mill is probably number two. Well, had your third choice. Food processor. <laughs> there you go. Okay. So I like that guy. Build a plate. Yeah. Those three guys there. Boy, we are. That does using not some look good today. at all. Yeah, I know, right? Are we out of spoons? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> okay, then we're going to put our figs right in the middle. This little pile of them right there. Oh, it smells so good. I'm telling you, this is absolutely gets you out of jail. <laughs> Don't try it, but I mean. Okay, <laughs> I'll try to stay out of jail. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe if Dwayne gets put in jail, then to bail him out, mm -hmm. I'll make it. Hmm. Okay, then a little bit extra more chives on there. And our last piece de resistance, a little extra Roquefort cheese on it. And boom. Wow and wow. I'm telling you. Okay. I'll lift that up for them. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. <laughs> we are going to chow that down. Yeah. 
<laughs> we'll take a picture first for you guys, though. Okay. Okay. And we'll go ahead and throw it back to you guys in the studio.